How to add custom watermark in TradingView. Hello and welcome to our channel. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add custom watermark in TradingView. So please watch till the end to properly understand the tutorial. And don't forget that you're going to be able to find the TradingView signup link and website link in the description of this video. So probably you have seen some charts on this way. But if you want to add a watermark, you need to access to the super chart that is this indeed. So after you are here in the left panel, you're going to have several options. This is the text, but this is going to give us a new menu. And at the end, we have the option to add an image. So there you're going to choose your image from your computer. And once you have done that, you can check the transparency too. So let's say this transparency and there it is our image. So when you click in your image, there are several things that you must know. First of all, that you can change its transparency again, going into settings. And there is going to be the style where you can select the transparency again, the best ability. So I want to see this in seconds, minutes, hours, days, and so on, all those ranges. But if probably in hours, I uncheck this option and I make the OK option. Let's check if this is how it works. Yes. Right now I'm in an hour per tick, so there is no an image there. So this image, you can check or uncheck the different ranges that you want to show the watermark. And finally, this is going to stay with its candlestick. I mean, if you have new candlesticks by here, the image is going to be there and you must to drag and drop it into the new place again. So that's how it works. There is no way to check this image to move along with the candlesticks. Okay. And obviously you can lock this. In that way, you're not going to be able to move it if you want just to move an order or so on. And obviously to delete it at the end. And that's it. That's how you're going to be able to add a custom watermark in TradingView. Thanks for watching.